So for this next little project, I need you to either choose UI Draw or Dry Island. I'm going to go with UI Draw. And then I'm going to come down, click on the little Add Media, find my picture. The picture is bigger. Ideally, look for the little yellow dots. And then you'll see what's called a scale arrow. And then you are going to scale down your picture until it kind of fits onto the screen. Then choose either your drawing or painting tool. For this one, I'm going to go with a plain line. So you see the difference in them. I'm going to choose a color. I'm just going to grab purple. And then I'm going to try and reproduce this using these tools. So right now it's got a straight line that goes across and it kind of comes up. It's a little thicker, so I'm going to kind of fill it in. The next line comes across, starts a little bit earlier, kind of like curves over. And again, this is not going to ideally be exact. So again, don't panic if it's not. Your goal is to try and see how is it to reproduce a image in the computer versus drawing it on a piece of paper. Again, if you are a perfectionist, you may want to try some other tools. Again, right now I'm just using the draw tool. I can come down here and try it with a paintbrush if I want. See if that gives me a little bit better quality of what I'm hoping for. Or you may decide to come down to shapes. Maybe you want to try and use more of like a rectangle. So again, part of this is you figuring out, you kind of exploring, figuring out what works for you. That's way too big. Remember, you do have control Z to go back. But again, the goal is to see if you can reproduce your drawing as a computer drawing.